This is a song from Flow Rider. Man, honestly. Man, look. This song is just bombarded with occult symbolism, that's all it's bombarded with. And it's bombarded as well with over-sexualization. This song is about sex, like always. First of all, we got the moon. Looks like the moon worship here. That's what it looks like. We all know that the Islam worship the moon as a god. The moon, the false moon god. And if you look at this guy's t-shirt, look at it here. This may be just... Her look may just be... From me here, it looks like an all-seeing eye. The eyelashes going up. The Illuminati triangle here may not be, but... If you look at it closely, it does look like an all-seeing eye of the Illuminati. You never know with these people. Because they put symbolism hidden in plain sight. So, I mean, it really does look like an OC. Now you got a little blue. And then you got the white, which would be the pupil. Which would be the back of the pupil. This would be the pupil there. Does look like an OC. Now, honestly does. And then what have we got here? The Masonic checkerboard floor. This is just an excuse to promote it. Why of all cars did they pick this? I mean, with the Masonic checkerboard floor, the Freemason Lodge. Black and white darkness becomes one with light. It's a cult agenda. I mean, you got the moon worship all over the place. There. There. Seems to be every single shop is as full of moon worship. The false moon god. Oh, what have we got here? Wearing a satanic star. I mean, from an angle, it looks like the pentagram. Really does. But then again, the normal star is connected to the pentagram anyway. I mean, the normal, even the normal stars in the Freemason Lodge. And this here just looks to me like mockery of the Holy Spirit. You got this like dove carrying something. I mean, these people will put the dove in movie, music videos to mock the Holy Spirit. Because the dove is known as the Holy Spirit. And look what we have here. This is no surprise. We all know what this is. We'll see an eye of the Illuminati. This looks like a brothel or something. Wouldn't surprise me. But you got the all seeing eye of the Illuminati, the one eye symbolism, the eye of Horus, the eye of Lucifer is the all seeing eye. They just love to throw out the all seeing eye in their music videos. They just love it. Well, then look what we have. Not really surprised, to be honest. And I've exposed this guy before. He's basically got tattoos of the owl. He's got tattoos of the Illuminati. He's a well-known sellout. Thrown at the devil horns, two fingers in, two fingers up. Saluting the devil because he's a sellout. And that's all he is. I mean, that's why he's got a tattoo of the owl. Because he's a complete sellout. I just see from the devil horns up, not even trying to hide it. And if you look at here, what he's wearing looks like the Knights Templar's cross. It really does. It's not a Christian cross, though. It's the Knights Templar's because you can see the points. It curves. That's the Knights Templar's cross, also connected to the SS and the. Nazis and also the Knights Templars. It's all connected. 